In this next demonstration, I'm going to take you through the deployment and management experience for users on our VPC hours-based licensing option. Once you've built your integrations, you generally go to deploy and manage them. Whether you're coming from designer authoring or toolkit, when you're ready to deploy, you generate a runtime artifact out of either of those experiences. Within the managed service, you have your dashboard. We'll start first by creating the runtime. Here, I'm selecting a small one, and then navigating to the top section to import my bar file. For this example, I'm loading in a customer database bar file, which is a REST. Once I've selected the bar file, I can then apply any configurations I'd like to see. This can include things like accounts, policies, certificates, or anything else I need. Once satisfied, I provide a name, customer database, and then I have the option to customize more settings, like adding additional bar files. I then click Create, which will get my runtime up and running with my bar file. Next, I jump over to my built-in logs viewer and filter the view for the last 15 minutes. After a quick refresh, I can see my instance starting to initialize and everything starting to spin up. And sure enough, I can now see the application runtime has gotten started. Navigating back to my runtime page and refreshing here as well, I'll see the status also update to ready. Perfect. I can explore more about my runtime by taking a look at some of the additional settings like security and endpoints. And because this is a REST API, I can see what operations are available and try those out from within the experience. Excellent. In this demo, we were able to see how quick and easy it is to deploy a runtime artifact and make customizations to fit the exact needs of our business. Thank you for joining us and learn more by taking advantage of our App Connect as a Service trial.